fifty. I mean, this is so, a small address. Yeah, I think private property. No, I think we just maybe we honk. Maybe his men had just had enough. So what is it? What exactly is it your team is looking to find out here? An artifact that may have been taken from the city. Uh, if it's a large enough sample, we can analyze its composition and use that data to, geolo to, to geolocate its origin. And find the lost, and find Cop Hatch. The center of the mine world for a thousand years. Mm -hmm. So here we are, Griffith Park, and we're playing this scene here as being part of Guatemala. And luckily it's been raining so much that even though a couple weeks ago it was dry and brown and gray, now it actually looks pretty pretty green. So we just kind of make sure we don't show any of the uh, surrounding infrastructure. But this is one of the few places in Griffith Park that's both level and sort of enclosed enough with green to pass, hopefully, for the rainforest. This is a purely gravy shot, so I'm not too broken up about it. If it doesn't work. Could be some tasty gravy. Yeah, it would be tasty gravy. Ready. And action. <laughs> okay, now mix that in between your fingers. Yep, good. Uh huh, good. This time, give me a, uh, give me just a a shade of contempt mm -hmm. for he got. He got you. He has the last. He had, you know, he got to you last. Here we go. And action. How do you think um, all the time that gets put into movie making equates to um, the viewer's experience? Well, the, the more time run? you put into it, the more takes you can do, and the better perfect you, can, the better you can perfect it. So, for instance, our wonder at the Stella, we did something like 21 takes of that, and, but we, we needed to because it's a wonder. So there's nothing to cut away to. So it has to stand on its own. Mm. But I don't think there's anything, I never get discouraged when you spend a lot of time on a single thing because it's a movie. You See, I just see power lines, which is the problem. Mm -hmm. So, unless the whole, unless you're looking and you see it here. That, so funny if I actually get away with this. Yeah. So here we are, in the van, prepping it for tomorrow's poor man's process shoot Ooh, of Matheson and Gentry's Escape from Flores. This is a good map, maybe, that we can use. Map? Auspicious. And it goes from you guys running into the headlights, you know, yeah. to then pushing in as you both pile in. Get in, get in, get in, get in! It's filthy in here, guys, I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm telling you right now, it's disgusting. A donde diablo vamos, Juan Carlos? Allá un pueblo en la cuenca de Mirador, Miguel. Okay, it's who you mean around this ten rules. It's even better than the one I took on the... on the hike. Can you see me, Bob? Can you see me? You think it's a joke now, huh? You think this is a big joke, huh? Well, look at this, you son of a- Having already been there once, I can tell you that getting from A to B in Guatemala using public transportation is not only difficult, it's incredibly time consuming. A better alternative would be to hire a fixer, a local who owns his own car, speaks the language, knows the lay of the land. This is somebody who can pick us up from the airport, uh, take us to the various locations, act as translator and negotiator, and, and really help take a big weight off my shoulders because now I can focus on the movie and not be so concerned with the logistics of making it. To really capture the sights and sounds of Guatemala, to put the audience in the character's shoes, we have to go to Guatemala. And that's what we're doing. Waiting for our, our lift to get here. And then we have to pick up Jake, and then we're going to go to the airport. LAX? Yes, yep. sir. But we have to make two stops first. Mm, double check and make sure that I have my What's up, Bob? Hey, what's up, Alan? I see you got the camera. Yeah. <laughs> Perfect. Such a morning person. This is unfolding like the Blair Witch Project right now. <laughs> exactly. You see the bag of marshmallows? And yeah. You get that grocery yeah. store. Even if power, power is small city. So she just told us that our flight has been changed, so now we're leaving here, LA, at 11 at night, 11 in the evening. And it's a red eye flight, and we get in at 7 a.m. But now, but now we're going to speak to the supervisor and see if we can maybe gerrymander the rule a little bit there. Because that's a real crazy, it's just not fair to us. We have a very tight schedule. No wiggle room. So our flight's been delayed 24 hours. 
Hey. <laughs> Day two. <laughs> Let's try it again. So our flight, our second half of the flight was delayed, so we have to spend the night in San Salvador now. The, San boys, Salvador. the boys are scared, but I'm not. I'm okay with it. I'm just pissed that we're going to lose so much time. What? It's the nature of flying abroad. Same yeah. happens. Welcome to Guatemala. Ms. Chica? Hi, Ryan. Hi, Ryan. Nice Ryan to meet you. Ryan. 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 Um, documentary. Oh. Production documentary. And Wonderful. TV commercials. Wow. And I do art. Wow. That's so funny. I, I was so surprised you think when, so? when, yeah, I'm very surprised because the last thing I think is that Guatemala has a has yeah. a film, has a whole film industry. No, I, we don't have an industry. Well, but we try. It looks like you do. I, yeah. It, so here we are, and uh, we are getting everything ready to go to film uh, with two boats. And hopefully we won't have anybody else on the water. And through our translator, Moppy, we're trying to convey to the boat driver exactly what we want so we can make this look as good as it looks. Now, just between you and me, I haven't asked the boat pilot yet if he's willing to play the role of the boat pilot, but I'm hoping he'll say yes. Can we drive boats uh, back to almost where we start and then come back again? Sí. Let's do that. Let's go there and back. Claro. And then Entonces, I. Entonces, si podemos volver a donde empezamos, vamos con el motor mm -hmm. y luego regresamos. Va a grabar eso y ya luego se pasa a este para grabar la playa allá. And then we go to the playa. I slept like a rock last night. I think we all did. But uh, I do feel, um, you know, on, in hindsight, like uh, we sort of threw about 25% of yesterday's shoot under the bus. And uh, the boat stuff looks fabulous, but the stuff with Ryan and his makeup, I'm not so hot on. So we're going to move forward, and I think that's the only thing to do, is to accept that that's what you've got, and plan to make the best of it in post, and think on your feet, and uh, learn from your mistakes. So that's what we'll do moving forward. We'll learn from our mistakes, and we'll try to make the next uh, leg of this journey even more productive, creative, and um, artistically satisfying. This is the Ah, oh, there it goes. It is in the room. Ah, okay, bueno. Ah, Light, la luz. Bug nets. Yeah, Bug yeah. nets, good Ooh. because this is a. Yeah. Well, are we able to access the river? You are in your mind, at least. Yeah. In your mind, the idea is that if you actually never even left the city, yeah. but in your mind, just like in a dream, you've jumped ahead in time, yeah. and now you're on the river. And you have followed the river, and hopefully that comes through. Mappy, you have the keys to the car? No. Okay. Where are they? I don't know. It could be in the trunk. I know, no, no, I got it. I got it. I was about to lock the car, and I was like, you know, camera, memory card, extra batteries for the camera and the boom. Boom pole, we don't have the boom pole. What? No. Boom pole. Boom pole? Yeah. You have? No, I we need, need. necessity. Oh. Pero el arroz todavía falta, ¿verdad? Sí, ya va a estar. Ah, va. Little pit stop for the boys. Oh, yo. 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 O
Oh my god. Papas fritas. Delicious. Oh! Let's get Oh! Yaksha <laughs> to film the ruins and uh, this tree has fallen by the side of the road but like everything else on this trip at the last moment it all works out and sure enough here's a park personnel person I think he's with the park hacking <laughs> with a machete which is grassy senor what? We are not going to enter right now. We have to wait an Till, hour? Yeah. It's for the killing scene. <laughs> that, that is a killing knife. Is it a clean knife? Maybe it has some blood. <laughs> right. <laughs> did you tell me we are making peanut butter and jellies? What? <laughs> like, did you tell me we are making peanut butter and jellies? No, I don't like peanut butter. <laughs> no, but did you see how no? it's being used with peanut butter and jelly? I don't understand. Oh, a crop no. So I'm recording. Button. Okay. And We had to cut our day short in Yasha today because it was just, it just wasn't, it wasn't working out. So we're back. Oh yeah, we heard it. Hey, look, I got some of this uh, supplement stuff you throw in your water. Antioxidants, electrolytes, amino acids, vitamin C, herbal extracts. Right. And you're sweating bullets. Had diarrhea? I know. And then right when I flush, I was like, oh shit. Not to diminish the awfulness of what you just experienced when we are filming in an hour and a half. Went to bed around 6.30, 7 o'clock, and then Ryan came back from dinner with Moppy, and around 10.30, Ryan started puking. <laughs> so the three of us were, um, were very sick, deathly ill, purged everything we had. And then he goes to use the bathroom, and then you start to trip out. Dude, you look like shit. <laughs> and you hear voices calling you to his backpack, which has the codex in it. And then he comes back, and you go, way to go, Gentry, and then you, you, you knock oh, him out. Yeah. I just thought that that was separate from the, it just keeps going. It's that scene, that's the scene. Well, that's when I take the tick off his back, right? I mean, they're two separate scenes. Right? And you don't take a tick off his back. Well, I find the ticks on him, or he has ticks all over. Yeah, you say, I'm starting to see why it's called the city of ticks, because you see he's got these bu bug bites on his arm. We are currently at Ishlu, which has not been excavated at all, but it's got great jungle for what we need, and it's right next to our hotel. But uh, you can still see where the temples were, those giant mounds of earth, that to the untrained eye are just that. But to the studied expert, temples. Sorry, and, can we uh, start that over one more we're, time? We're out of gas, and uh, we, uh, we're we just um, hoping we can get there. Ustedes no tienen un poco de gasolina que nos puedan vender? No. Only a little. Solo un poco. Lo que pasa es de que estamos en reserva y nos acabamos de dar cuenta. Uh, y si nos pueden dar solo un poco para llegar a la gasolinera allá afuera. Just tell him we can't get gas. We can't get gas. Okay. Okay, let's do that, we'll go down there, shoot this, and then drive as far up as we can. And assuming we don't run out of gas, get to a gas station. And if not, this will we'll push, and we'll shoot it.
<laughs> and we'll see what we can do. Maybe if it means that the three of us have to get on motorcycles and drive to a gas station, then there's our second hitchhiking scene right there. But let's go. <laughs> let's go. <laughs> Your flight's not till 8. You got well, one. Rob, guess what? What? Good news is we got gas. Yeah. Oh, we do have gas. And those monkeys are terrifying. Amazing, they are amazing. So you can like stagger over this and then you can come here and like, like Breather. you're dizzy, your head dizzy. is swimming. Yeah. And then you're gonna just sort of continue along the edge. You can use the wall to sort of uh, support you. Great. Good. Cool. Good stuff. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Definitely. Awesome. Uh, her side. Okay. Ah, fuck. Un michelada con no hielo, no hielo. Y a pijitas con pollo y papas también. Uh, fajitas de pollo y uh, botella de agua. El último uh, botella de agua también para mí. <laughs> y quiero sopa de frijol con arroz y pollo. Por favor. Incluso alrededor vamos a ver iguanas si desean parar a mirar unas iguanas. Yo creo que iguanas y desserts. No. No. You're leaving. We're leaving, and uh, you're leaving. What and, happens uh, next? And uh, Moppy and I drive down to Guatemala City tomorrow. Uh, you guys, um, you're gonna take one of my hard drives with you to ensure that the footage gets back safely. I take one, you take one, and um, yeah, this is where we part ways temporarily. <laughs> we couldn't have done this without you, you know. Yeah, you could. No way. No. It's no. It's just a flat no. I think it's possible. I mean, you'll be at the premiere, so. That's right. We'll see you in LA okay. this summer. Exactly. All right. All right, guys. Let's do it. Bye, guys. See ya. See ya.